are going to open out these squid sacks using a knife. We're going to just slice into them and open them out into what you could call a squid steak. What you're going to do is take a knife, a nice sharp knife, and slide it inside your squid and just open it out, okay, like so. So, like so, and I'm gonna do that with all of them, and then I'm gonna dry the inside out with paper towel. These have already um, been washed before they were frozen, so the inside, they, they run water through it. You can do it yourself too if you want to. You can rewash it and then dry it. Um, if I was cleaning a whole squid, I wash them like this. I just, under the tap, run water through the sack like this. That is all of my squid bodies opened out. There we go. I'm gonna grab more paper towel. And just, again, dry them. And then we're gonna score them. You don't have to do this, um, but it looks kind of pretty. And we're gonna, when we score them, we're gonna score the inside, not the outside which is gonna help them curl so that you get those, like if in a Chinese restaurant when you order squid and you get those curled pieces of squid, um, that's because we've taken the time to score them. Um, this one has a little bit of the backbone. A squid has this little clear um, backbone. It's kind of cool, that's only a little bit of it. it it's usually like it's a wide piece. Um, a squid is, a, I believe it's a cephalopod, and they have these clear, um, flexible spines. They're kind of cool. What we're going to do, sometimes I'll just trim this up a little bit. Um, the wider edge sometimes has a little cartilage that you might want to trim off. I'm going to do that. I'm just going to trim off the cartilage here. <coughs> Excuse me. Then I'm going to take my knife, and I'm just scoring with my knife into the flesh without going all the way through. I've got a nice sharp knife here. I'm making sure I don't go all the way through. And then I'm gonna turn it, so you can see I've scored it one way there. I'm gonna turn it, and I'm gonna score in the other direction so I have a diamond pattern. And then I'm gonna cut into like fingers. So these are my pieces of squid like so. If you were cutting rings, we wouldn't have split it open. We would just cut it into rings like this. Okay, so that is my squid prepped. I'm gonna wash my hands again and then salt it. 